What the hell is an offer in contract law? Don't worry, I'm an expert. An offer is a clear statement of the terms on which one party, the offerer, is prepared to do business with another party, the offeree. That's amazing. Then what is unilateral? An offer of a promise in return for the performance of an act. Cool. Want to hear a joke? No. Doctor, doctor, I feel like a pair of curtains. The doctor says, oh, pull yourself together. Focus. Now isn't the time for jokes. A legally binding offer includes three things. 1. Clearly stated terms. 2. Intention to do business. And 3. Communication of that intention to do business. Do you want to hear another joke? The amount of detail on those three areas you gave. Okay then, here you go. The clearly stated terms mean that the statement won't be too vague to comprise a valid offer. For example, it is not clear if a buyer of a horse promises to pay a seller five or extra pounds if the horse was lucky for him. That is not clear. Okay. The intention to do business needs to indicate commitment. Some people confuse invitation to treat and negotiation as a legally binding offer so be careful. As for the communication of the offer, people must know about the offer to be able to accept it. How can you cancel the offer? That is called termination. This can happen if the offeree dies, if the offer is refused, if a specific time passes before acceptance or if the offer is withdrawn before it is accepted. That is the end. Thanks so much. That's so helpful. I've got to go now. I've got a doctor's appointment. See you soon. An offer can be bilateral or unilateral. Most are bilateral, whereby there is a contractual promise of performance of an act in return for the other party's promise of performance.